Hello everyone, this is Gali and welcome to a new artist feature. Today we're going to look at one of the greatest artists that I've been following for 11 years in DeviantArt. This one is Alektor Fencer. She's wonderful, she's from Germany. And since I can remember, she's been doing beautiful illustrations in Photoshop, maybe traditionally as well, but I think Photoshop was a... or digital was the highest one. So we're gonna look for some of her pictures that I've loved forever. So for that I'm going to go to her gallery. Just go all the way down first. She has... Um, yeah, traditional C. Well, or does digital. Well, whatever. She draws everything. This is traditional, I think. As you can see, I enjoy artists that have a lot of vari variety in what they do, like the backgrounds and animals and creatures, even banana sculptures. <laughs> so yeah, she has this gorgeous creature called Plant Spirit that goes through her gallery. It's like a wolf with plants on it. And it's so natural, so beautiful. This, I believe, was one of the best pictures I've seen of her and this is as she started you can see she's still really good but her character has been here for years so I'm really happy she made her book so her comic is called um, Meyer M-Y-R-E and apparently it's doing really well and I'm happy for her so this is where she started as you can see she did use traditional media and some digital too. She started with creatures. And we're gonna get a tour to the most wonderful gallery full of color and nature. So this is the plant spirit. You can see he's still here and here and everywhere. Here, here. It's a gorgeous creature. So we're gonna look at well let's see, let's find one of the ones I like the most. I separated two. <clears throat> this one is just beautiful. The light and shadow, the background, the creature, how it looks like it's made of smoke. And this one, like, all fierce and beautiful as well. This one was one of the first I saw. It's from 2010. And it's really good. She's gotten even better, but... And this one is from 2009. And this character you will see again. It's called Varug, I think. It's ne not new because he's been in her mind for a while, I think. And as you can see, he's still here. And I'll show you. Show you what she has done with Varug soon. So we're gonna see beautiful drawings of animals. And this one apparently is traditional media. So yeah, she draws with everything. This one is from 2010 as well. And I'm going to show you what I really like about her work is the lineless feel. She has no liner in many of her drawings. And it feels all 3D and wonderful. As you can see, she loves contrasting colors, and textures, and nature. And it's really inspiring to see the nature and the world that may not live in reality. It's so wonderful. I love the plants and everything she draws. And I'm going to show you one of my favorite pictures. Just let me find it. So you can see she can draw anthro, normal animals, um, dragons, wolves, everything. This is really good. She likes composition and she, I believe, gives her brushes here. So, this is her, this is Meyer, the, the new comic she made, or graphic novel, I don't know how you call that. Look at this, how wonderful. Okay, so, now you can see Varug in the different style and you can still see the plant spirit everywhere 
She's still doing it. So, my favorite picture. I think I passed it. Ah, here, here, here. Look at this! It's a ghost dragon! So cool. She could be a concept artist if she's not already, because this is really wonderful. This is for her what comic or series or yeah. Whatever that is is still wonderful. So remember this character. Ta-da! Now you can see him in all his glory. With Meyer. So gorgeous. So follow your dreams because you can see after a while you can achieve them. She did the campaign in Indiegogo, I think. And now look! It's here! It's here! She did it. And it looks really good. You can see the contrast of the shadows and the colors and the design and now how beautifully simple it looks. So yeah, follow your dreams people. She's a test, you can do it. Really good. And these are her brushes. So you can donate to get her brushes or you can download them as well. Here, you click here and it downloads. So thank you for that because it's really wonderful. And I think she used it to make this, but just look at the detail. Okay, so this is one of my, my favorite ones as well. It looks like a poster. And it's so good, the composition is beautiful and the shading and all. I enjoy the way she draws backgrounds. It's like you're there, like it's real. So yeah, even the simple backgrounds look wonderful. She reminds me a little bit of Sendara in the sense that her creatures look so whimsical and so colorful at the same time. You can believe they're right there next to you. And so yeah, please follow her. She's alectorfencer.deviantart.com And I believe she has more things, but let me check. So this is her. I think she has a deviousness award. Yeah, she does. 12 years in DeviantArt. She's awesome. And what else? I don't know if she has a Tumblr. If she does, she might tell you. Oh, here. here, here, here. No, but she does have a website for her UP for Meyer. So you can buy it, I think. You can visit her website. It's called Yuya Chronicles, right here. So just look at this beautiful website. You have the sample pages, the cast, and wow, looks really good. So you can get your own copy, and that's it about them. You have her mini comics, her art. These are really funny. So yeah, that's all for now. I really hope you enjoyed this artist picture because I truly enjoy her art. So if you like, please subscribe and click the bell icon on the top of my profile, which will let you know when I submit new videos. So thank you for watching guys, bye bye!